It's spring. I heard the little birdies. Why are you sprung? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions. It's some Corbin. I'm Rick. Rick Falls on Instagram. It's Twitter for more juicy Twitter. content. It's so Thanks, juicy. Thanks for the Follow the account. Ring the bell to get squad. Bang! Also on personal YouTube channel. Links in the what do you do? I'm teaching them how to milk a cat. Stop it. That's it's how it works. Uh, <laughs> uh, so today, a new trailer dropped. I think it was yesterday. I could be wrong. Uh, or just a few days ago. Sorry. Uh, it's called Wild Dog. Yep. Stupid babies who have sent me messages. There you go. <laughs> Which is amazing because it's, it's, I, I have, um, for the better part of a year, I would consistently let people know on Instagram and Twitter, guys, don't send me reaction requests. You're wasting your time. I, it's gonna, it'll never end. And they still send them to me. And then when I tell them, when they, I finally communicate to them, they're like, yeah, I know, but Corbin ignores me. I'm like, well, what do you expect me to do? <laughs> well, go talk to us or the stupid family. It, they, and when I tell them that, there's, this is, there's a format. Uh, so this is called Wild Dog. I, I don't know the language here, so please somebody inform me. I was, uh, I think it might be South, but I don't know which South. Uh, whether it's Malayalam, Telugu, Tamil, Canada, I don't know. I didn't get that information yet. All right. Uh, but, uh, it's starring, um, Akanini Nagarjuna, Salyami Kerr, Ahishore Solomon, Niranjan Reddy. And let me see if it has a Watch Wild Dog trailer. We're about to. Okay. <laughs> no other information. It's just been requested a lot. Uh, it already has 11 million views. Nice. Uh, I'm turning on the sound. I'm sorry for the delay. Here we go. Now the question is, who is he? Pakistan Mithi College in the Riyadh Bhai Chisadu. Hi, Indra. Pokhade Abba Kutera. Ikkar Vahid Peru Dr. Yusuf, a religious preacher. He put ISA protection on her. Badu Yorka Viladam, Ante Izi Kwaadu. Oh. What is this John Wick? All the headshots. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Best ending to 
a trailer ever. I do love that word. Best ending to a trailer we've had thus far. That is hilarious. But, but far. That's <laughs> great ending. I do love it. Uh, that Somebody look, send this to Nawaz. Yeah. Let them know we endorse it. Mada Mada <laughs> I loved it. That was loved it. One that it was very. Anytime you see that many headshots, it just John Wick comes to mind instantly. And, and not, if you haven't seen John Wick and you like action, obviously this doesn't look like John Wick. Not at all. Obviously, no. not comparing it. But in terms of if you see something with that many headshots, that, I mean. John Wick is just now... It's the king of headshots. That's what you go see the film for. Exactly. <laughs> it and is. Now, I don't know if that's what this is going to be, but it, this one is based off a true story. Well, it... Okay. So, first of all, the trailer. Um, what a magnificent way to draw us in and show those young girls having a good night out, and all of a sudden, they just get blown up right in front of your face. I didn't expect you, that. Not at all. I was instantly like, what the hell is going on? Yeah. Then, you get... Clearly, the wild dog is this cop who's like, yeah, no, you're not going to court. <laughs> I'm going to figure out a way to justify the fact that I had to use lethal force. Bye. Yeah. Uh, which is always fun to watch on film. It's very cathartic. But the actual, like, the artistic quality and genre, it immediately brought to mind any of the action things that J.J. Abrams does, including the Mission Impossible films. Oh. It's just the quality of the, the editing and the cinematography and the action choreography. And man, I, I love those films. This looks great. Yeah, this looks like a lot of fun. Uh, well, fun in certain parts. Obviously, if it's based off a true story, yeah. I'm sure that won't be very fun because obviously it looks like a terrorist attack that blew up a bunch of people. But it will be fun if it's a true story. And you get a, to watch this guy get and kill a bunch of terrorists? Yep. Yeah, that is fun. That is fun. That is absolutely fun. Yep. Uh, a dramatic pre presentation of the August 2007 Hyderabad bombings and his investigation told through NIA point of view. Cool. Interesting. Uh, releases April 2nd. Yep. Uh, I don't know... I don't know if it's releasing in theaters in India. I, it, like Once again, you know, I almost guarantee it's not releasing it, in theaters. Not here. here. Um, but... Uh, Highly likely it would in India because I know theaters are open there. Mm. Um, I'd love to be able to get our hands on seeing it. And obviously when you're dealing with a true story, I don't mind, you know, like this looks like it's obviously the action sequences are going to be stylized and out of, um, they're going to be, for lack of a better term, Hollywoodized. And I don't mean that to, I only mean that in terms of it not being realistic. Yeah. You know what I mean? Being being stylized for that stunt choreography, fight choreography, um, and and over-exaggerating that aspect of it. My hope is that, when you're telling a true story, that the majority of what we're gonna see actually took place. Yeah. But they may, you know, when, they, when those guys got arrested and shot, it might not have been as grandiose as what we see in the action sequences. Yeah. But as far as the actual people who died, the bombings and the investigation, I'm hoping this is true to history. Also, do you, you remember what the, his name is? In this? Yes, VJ Varma. I don't know if that's a common name, but it threw me off. Yeah, I know, me too. VJ Varma, I, I know. I had a little brain glitch. My brain kind of went, huh? wait, VJ Varma. Like, I guess it's It'd be like I'm saying, uh, who's, the, who's the cop? Rithik Roshan. Wait, huh? What? Um, even, so I, it, I, I think it is a common I name. I think it's a common name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's not like if you said Shah Rukh Khan. No, no, I think it's like, like that, John that Smith. joke in, in uh, Parch. I, you, you sat on Shah Rukh Khan. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, that's that's not a common name. But I think BJ Barmas is common to, like, Bob Smith, John Williams. Those are really common American names. And they're gotcha. very common. Yeah, in the offers thing. Like, Me too. Our dost? BJ Barma? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody we've interviewed is our dost. It's true. They're, we're best friends now. Every single one of them. But, yeah, looked really good. Uh, I, it looks like a lot of fun. It looks like one, also, based on a true incident, I don't believe we know anything about. Again, no. Um, which uh, I would like to. So uh, let us know about this film. Let us, I, don't, I don't think we know anybody in it either. Yeah, I didn't so, just uh, let us know any of the information we need to know down below. <laughs> Look, my, that's